The Greater Peterborough Chamber of Commerce is participating in a day of advocacy over the proposed pension plan by the Ontario government. The plan is being designed as we speak, and this is why we've chosen October 8th to participate. As they are developing it, we're hoping that we can make business concerns known. A number of the concerns are the fact that it could have an impact on our competitiveness as well as job creation. A recent survey in Emerging Stronger through the Ontario Chamber of Commerce showed that 72% of businesses believe that pension reform is necessary. However, they do feel that an Ontario pension plan is not necessarily the way to go. They are interested in pooled registered pension plans, which allow some flexibility on the part of the employer. They would be mandatory for employees, but contributions by the employer would be flexible and they could choose whether or not they want to do that. Some of the concerns with the pension plan is that it's, it's a cumulative effect. Already we see high electricity costs as well as high WSIB premiums for small and medium enterprises. And adding this on could create an extended burden. We already know if you crunch the numbers that have been provided by the Ontario government, they're looking for 1.9% from employees and 1.9% from the employer. For an employer that has say five employees or five to 10 employees that make around an average of $45,000 a year, that's anywhere from a $4,000 to an $8,000 increase on the bottom line that they would be paying out in payroll taxes. And that can be a concern because as mentioned, it can lead to some concerns about competitiveness in the market as well as job creation. The Greater Peterborough Chamber of Commerce wants to hear from you, our members. You can reach us on Twitter at PTBO Chamber or on our Facebook page, the Greater Peterborough Chamber of Commerce. Thank you.